course, you can do data in a fast enough way to hear your experience properly. Nope, this isn't the control room. I'm in the control room. Thank you. Exactly. Okay, so you're the one who's going to click go live then, yeah? You ready? Go ahead. Looks like yeah, we're live or not. Yep. Are we live? I think we're already live. I can see her. You're live. Touchdown? Do you have the chat? No. I'll get you the chat. I feel like I should dance or entertain you in some you way. Could. I, you could. You know, well, there's always like music in my head. I can show you rocks. Hello, if you can see me. I don't know. Someone said, is this the Twilight Zone? Feels like it sometimes. It certainly does. <laughs> I don't know. <coughs> I just work here. Um, this is Dave. Hi. <laughs> uh, uh, chats. Are you good? Is that does that work? That like looks that? like a chat. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. All right. Have it's fun. looking good. Thank you, Dave. Yeah. Told you it might be weird today, didn't I? Thank you, Karen Brown. If this is happening now, what's going to happen during Mercury retrograde? It's going to be a shit show. <laughs> I mean, honestly, Mercury retrograde on Samhain. It's going to be like. Cool. If I was an ancestor, I'd be all over that shit. I'd be like, Mercury retrograde on Samhain? I'm in for that. I'm flying down for that. You know what I mean? Even if I was in heaven and just having a great day, I would be like, I'm still going to push pause and go have some fun with my um, living ancestors. Okay. I don't know what's happening right now. Like I said, I only work here. And so <laughs> your guess is as good as mine. I do have other really pretty things to show you. Okay. If you're new, this this doesn't really happen like this. I don't know. It must be ayahuasca. Somebody said it was a 420 break, and I didn't even think about it, but it did happen around 420. <laughs> if that was a 420 break, we didn't get to enjoy it. And that's not fair. Okay. Um, so, a couple of months ago, I'm going to jump right in. A couple of months ago, we had portal opening wands made for us out of gray aventurine. Gray aventurine grows at the border of sort of indigo, blue aventurine, right? It's this shadowy stone um, that has uh, tourmaline inclusions in it, and I'm in love. So we went back to the people who made the wands, and they made us spheres. So if you're my student, you know what a portal is, you know how you have to open a portal and then assign a portal keeper energetically and that maintains the space. This is a stone to use when you've opened a portal. Um, I'll teach more about that in just a second. Now, we had these stone spheres made and then we had the uh, stands made. This is Picasso Jasper, which is the stone of integrating the wisdom of your ancestors. So it's the duo of these together for you today. We only have 16 of these. They're three to three and a half inches. So a portal is sort of a doorway to a different dimension of energy outside of this dimension. So we're in 3D right now, but when you go into 4D and 5D, you lose space and you lose time. And so that's where you can do really deep magic. So we're out of the bounds of what creates what we would call a human experience. And so I teach my students how to open portals, how to maintain portals, and then how to close portals. Because when you reach through a portal of energy, you can access energy from other dimensions, and it does, you can use that for healing, you can use it for transformation. Okay, um, this, the combination, you get the stand and the sphere is $59. Our regular price is $84 for the duo. So it's $59, your shipping's included if you're in the US, but like I said, I only have 16 of these. And this is if you're doing deeper dimensional work, shadow work, journey work, shamanic work of any kind, where you're working between the energy of the third dimension and the energy of the fifth and sixth dimensions, which is where you leave the human conceptions of space and time and boundaries and borders behind and you move into more of a universal energy. Aren't they beautiful? So gray aventurine, 
And it's really pretty. A lot of them are wishing spheres. And wishing spheres are spheres that have a line that goes all the way around them and creates sort of a circle within a circle. This one has double, triple. This one has three lines, no way. So there's a line all the way around the top, then there's a line, I don't know if you can see, all the way around the bottom, and then there's a line crossing the other axis. Whoever gets this one gets to make three wishes with the sphere. That is absolutely magnificent. And then the black line, which like I said, is most likely tourmaline material, there's actually a black line that crosses this sphere around the entire other direction. So I would say four wishes with this one. Eh, they're insane. Really, really beautiful. Isn't it fun? I hope you could see that when I was showing that to you. <laughs> I'm out of time right now, but I'll be back in time <clears throat> soon. Much to my chagrin. They are wands, so let's show them this. Let me show you. Okay, so we have two custom made wands tonight that I want to show you. These are super special. I have in my own collection, I have three wands by this particular wand maker, and they are among the most magical tools in my collection. This one is velvet obsidian, which is a form of rainbow obsidian with praiseolite, green amethyst, and laser quartz. So let me show you. There's only one of these. 21, yeah? Yes. Okay. <laughs> so let me show it to you. His wands are all done in silver, so they don't tarnish. They're really beautifully done. These are This particular wand is all made by hand, and it's one of a kind. So it's double terminated, which my students know what that means. Double terminated wands you use to open circles, you use to activate grids, you use to channel energy because it sends and receives. So it's like a transmitting tool of energy, okay? In the middle, this one has what's called a velvet obsidian uh, cabochon, which is a form of rainbow obsidian. You take this out in the light and you're gonna see every color in the rainbow there. And then above and below, I wanna really show this to you because these are unique stones. Above and below, these are cut and faceted green amethysts. Do you see that? Super gem grade and it's open on the back, the amethyst, so the energy of those green amethysts is going through. That is a healer of the physical body, green amethyst or praiseolite. On the face of those cut and faceted praiseolites are triangles. On the top, the point is pointing down, and on the bottom, the point is pointing up. So these are actually f stones facing each other, okay? And then these are laser quartz from Brazil that are etched isn't it beautiful? But they didn't over polish them because you don't want that. You want the natural energy of the quartz to remain. And so this was masterfully made and there's only one like this. So this one, the, um, our regular price on this one was 1,050. Our price tonight is 849 for a silver wand. That is about nine carats of cut and faceted gem grade green amethyst. And then, like I said, velvet obsidian and two terminations of the laser quartz. Isn't it beautiful? Nothing else like that. So who is this for? This is for somebody who is aligning their chakras and healing the physical body and wants to be able to receive energy from all dimensions to do that work. This is a crystal healer. A physical healer, perhaps, would want to work with this wand. Isn't it incredible? Um, someone who does direct body work is what I would say. This is somebody who's going to be working with clients where this wand would be used on the physical body. You could, of course, do remote distance energetic work with a wand like this, but this one, because of the praiseolite being such a powerful physical healer, but I'm, I wish I could show you the triangles. I think this one's gone already, but I want you to see the triangles on it, the facet. So when you get this one, you'll know how to hold it. Because again, the top praiseolite, the triangle on the face is facing down, and the bottom praiseolite, the triangle on the face is facing up. So this wand has a preferred north and south direction. So again, you can activate items with this wand. You can open circles with this wand. I can send energy to you and receive energy from you with this wand. You can activate a grid with this wand. Um, you can also use a wand like this because the terminations are so sharp to actually open the energy centers on the palms of your hands 
and the soles of your feet. And you do that clockwise. And then you put your palms together. And it opens a grid within your own body. Isn't that cool? Oh, by the way, did you know that anything that you buy tonight is on FlexPay? <laughs> Any purchase over $100, you have six weeks and four payments at no interest with your invoice. So I wanted to make sure you knew that too. If you buy anything over $100 tonight, you don't have to pay it all up front. You actually can separate it into four payments over six weeks at no cost to you. So when it comes time to pay your invoice, you'll have the option to do that too, which helps a lot. I mean, I think for a lot of us, and congratulations, I don't know who got that one, but I'm super excited for you. Yeah, everything on sagegoddess.com and all of our gem sales is on FlexPay. And there's no interest. It's not like a credit card. Isn't that exciting? Took us six months, by the way, to get that plug in on our website. And it works through our invoices, too. So anything you buy, you don't have to pay it all up front. Which, like I said, for me, I, most of the people I buy from don't have that, unfortunately. Wish they did. Um, but it's a, it's a real helper for some of you who are like... Yeah, so you can use credit cards, you can use PayPal, and everything's on FlexPay, and you can divide it by times four as long as it's. Yeah, you have to be in the U.S. That's the one sort of scratchy thing. And that's not our fault. That's the other country's faults that don't want to allow FlexPay. <laughs> but if you're in the U.S., you have QuadPay. Isn't that cool? We worked so hard to get that for you, so I'm glad that's helpful for you. Okay, shall we? Um, these are ceremonial and very powerful wands from Peru. I wish I had more of these. I have 23. I have just under two dozen of these. Um, I'm going to tell you about this first, okay? Um, we haven't had Chanta wands in probably... It's been, a, I think the last time was... It was <coughs> after Tucson, wasn't it? Yeah, February. So it's, been, it's been almost... Okay. Yeah. If we have them, it will be Tucson next year, which would be the end of February, if we have them. And he hasn't promised to have them yet, okay? This is Chonta. So this is, and it says made in Peru. This is Chonta wood right here, C-H-O-N-T-A, which is a highly protective wood used ceremonially in Peru for wands of this kind for protection, okay? On the front is what we call the Hunabku. This is, this is the Incan cross. This is a portal, and this has been hand carved out of Palo Santo wood. And then it's attached to the wand with leather. It has three beautiful chrysocolla cabochons, little buttons, that represent the lower world, the middle world, and the upper world. And then this is, I mean, this this quartz on top of this piece is Lemurian and has record keepers. These are, it's, <laughs> I don't know if you can see, there's about 10 different terminations on the face of this quartz point. So it's not just one point, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight terminations. And then this one is double terminated. Okay, um, same thing with this one. Now, shaman will use this to open portals, again, between dimensions. That's what we do when we're doing sacred work and ceremonial work, is we're, we're opening doorways to energies from other dimensions to come into this dimension for healing and for peace and for transmutation. Um, this, the, the, these don't exist elsewhere in the world, so it's really hard to give you what this would be worth. We had down as our retail value $6.99, I have 23 of them and they are $4.99. And that's it for this year. There are no more, these are handcrafted in Peru by hand. Each one takes at least a week to carve the wood, carve the Palo Santo, attach, carve and attach the, um, the cabochons on the front. Aren't they incredible? So when we are out of these, we will not have more of these. This is big magic from us to you. And it's even beautiful on the back, isn't it? Absolutely exquisite. Yeah, I mean, this is, if you feel called to it, it's your medicine. You know what I mean? It's magical wands. I have a collection of wands. If you've been in the classroom, you've seen my wands. Magical wands have to call to you. It's not like they call to everybody. And I think you have to have an intention or a vision or a purpose for healing or working with the one that you're that you're connected to, right? My students will probably want something like this because they're always looking for additional tools to use to call in the four directions. 
Um, you can activate, because the stone comes from Peru, all the stones come from Peru, the Palo Santo comes from Peru, and the Chonta wood comes from Peru to activate those energies in your ceremonial space too. So congratulations. We will let you know who got these. And again, like I said, I won't have, you'll be, you'll be coming back to me in November going, do you have any ceremonial wands for the holidays? And we don't. We actually don't have any more uh, Central or South American ceremonial wands ahead of the holidays. So if that's your question, like, are you going to have any more of these before Christmas? We don't. So this is it for us for ceremonial wands for 2019. But it's good for you to know that because some people will wait. Like, oh, I'll wait and see what she's got. And I can promise you, we've got good stuff for the holiday, but we don't have ceremonial wands like that. Isn't it amazing? No, they're not making the Peruvian stone wands anymore. If you got one of those, you got something very special. They're just not, they're just not carving them. There were none of them in Tucson this year, or maybe one or two, and there were none in Denver this year. And we're not projected to have any for... That's why, you know, but you know what's cool about that is when you get one, you know, I always tell you, I don't know if things will be back. And I think they're moving on to different forms and different structures of things. And so congratulations to those of you who have had those in the past, because I think it might be a thing of the past, unfortunately. Um, are there any more of the Chonta Wood wands? Mm -hmm. CR is asking. So, yeah, so if you still want a Chonta Wood wand, the Peruvian wands, we have a few um, left. <clears throat> yeah. I, okay. I, I, yeah, just a couple left. So if you are looking for that, um, now is the time. And we'll come back and let you know who got those. Congratulations, you guys. Okay. They are very interested in the friend. Do you have spinning okay. on your desk? Okay. This is my friend, and you can't even see his... I'll, um, I'll hold him up. Oh. I'm excited for you guys to see my friend. And by that, you mean me. Well, and, no, and also Alexis. I have, a, I have a bad shoulder, so she's not going to, she's going to lift it up. I'm not going to do it. It's too heavy for me right now. Okay. This is, mm, this is the largest phantom chlorite piece in the house and the last of its kind. I don't know if you can see the phantom in there. I love you, Alexis. The little green in there, that's chlorite. I love how you're holding it like a baby. <laughs> um, every point is terminated with a chlorite phantom. This one has three phantoms inside of it. So some of them, and even little babies have phantoms in them. Every single point is a chlorite phantom. Um, this piece, the retail value is 4500 Tonight is $29.99 for the largest phantom chlorite in the house, $2,999. It's almost half price. Um, <laughs> and it comes with this. We always take all the information about those larger pieces and engrave on a little Palo Santo disc, and it comes with a stand. So when you have it in your home, it's like a museum piece, right? And then you have the description and all the information there, too. Isn't it cool? <laughs> no. I, honestly, if you were at one of the gem shows, that would be a $5,000 piece. So the price on that is the absolute best that we could do. It's probably 20% below what you would see for almost a wholesale price on that for the show. Isn't it incredible? So if you need, and now what is chloride? Chloride is a physical healer, detoxifier. It's a really powerful stone for clearing pain, disease, especially old disease, like disease in your body that might be ancestral. You know how people in your family go, well, everybody had arthritis. Everybody had heart disease or whatever. It's that kind of clearing of those lineage patterns of disease and illness that, that chloride is responsible for. So I have a lot of people who come to me and will say, I'm a healer and I have to have a chloride piece for my, for my healing room. We don't always have chloride phantoms. So that's why that piece having a phantom on every termination is absolutely insane. And there's even some lithium um, do you see this? It's like lithium mm -hmm. phantoms down below, which is um, the lithium you'd have in medication for your brain. So this is going to be peace and healing. Really powerful combination. Wouldn't it be great in a healer's office? Did Bridget get it? Yes. Did she really? Ah, uh, congratulations, Bridget. That, we don't see pieces like that. Not chlorite phantoms like that. We see chlorite included quartz. We do on a fairly regular basis with the chlorite phantoms. And I think you've been around long enough to know I collect the individual pieces of chlorite phantoms. Even I don't have a chlorite cluster like that. So high five to you, girl. <laughs> 
GGB wants to know the Blue Cow Sydney generator winners. Do you want to go over that? How about someone said that they only have 30 minutes and they really wanted to get a surprise bag. So let's do surprise bags and then we'll announce. We'll do surprise bags. <clears throat> Your wish is our command. Okay. The surprise bags this week are really cool, by the way, too. So these are ancestral magic, connecting with your ancestors, honoring your ancestors. That's the work I'm doing right now in my practice. And so if you are too, then I can meet you there. Um, the way our surprise packages work, and we'll come back to the rest of the winners. Don't worry, Sparrow, I see you. We'll come back in just a few minutes. The team is sort of catching up, so let me give them a chance to catch up and then we'll announce everything for you. So the way that our surprise packages work is um, the price is $100. Uh, we only have 50 of them, but you get at least $200 worth of goodies. So you're going to get two candles, three perfumes, at least two juicy gemstone specimens, if not three. This one has the rarest skeletal celestial quartz I've ever offered. This was a $40 or $50 piece on its own. Um, and then you're going to get a smudge bundle, a small gemstone set, and flash tattoos. So it's 200, at least $200 worth of goods for $100 and your shipping's included. So that's why everybody, you see everybody go crazy because they know. But the theme is ancestry. So we've got Samhain candle, we've got an ancestor candle, honor perfume, remembrance perfume, free spirit perfume. This particular person is going to get a beautiful Picasso Jasper Palm Stone with skeletal celestial quartz with, with a mugwort or black sage bundle and a garnet organite pyramid with um, natural, um, goodness sake, that's petrified wood with uh, Picasso Jasper and a freeform obsidian piece, and then ancestral flash tattoos, like spirit allies. <laughs> it's a lot. Isn't it fun? That's like, and, and the reason I do this is, I have found as, as a grown up that I miss surprises. Do you ever find that? Like if I buy something, I know what it is. If someone gets me a gift, a lot of times they'll tell me like what they got me. And I miss surprises. So I do this because I think you probably do too. <laughs> so I get to surprise you with things, but at least you know the theme and you know that you're gonna get more than your money's worth. So you, uh, you know, what I love is, I know when this comes in the mail, that you guys feel like little kids, like what did she send me? And we take a lot of pleasure in delighting you and surprising you. So anyway, that's why I do it. Lindsay said they're actually steel bags. Are they steel <laughs> bags? I like that. <laughs> And, and we have a blast putting those together because we honestly think about you opening it. and Yeah, and uh, Tara, anything over $100, you can use quad pay. If you spend $100 tonight, when your invoice comes, you can spread your invoice over four months, uh, over, uh, sorry, two months over four payments. That's the benefit of quad pay. All right, now let's talk about winners. Okay, winners. Okay. The Peach Moonstone Generators went to Cindy Nolan. The and sex those, generators. Oh, sorry. Give me a sex generator. <laughs> I'll give you eight inches. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Did you hear Alexis? Sorry, everyone. No, you know what? <laughs> Pisces can be naughty, too. Don't let them fool you. They act like they're not <laughs> naughty, but they super are naughty. I okay. have Scorpio, right? And she has Scorpio rising. She said, I'll give you eight inches. Did you hear that? Mm hmm Okay. Go ahead. Cindy Nolan. <laughs> yeah, Cindy, Cindy Nolan and Ghost Nikki. And Ghost Nikki are getting sex generators, and we have two left. So if anybody's feeling called to some more sacral energy in your life, then we have two left of these in the house for you. All eight inches of it. <laughs> Congratulations, you guys. Yeah, I. this should be in the bedroom. Or if you have a creativity altar. What some of my clients are doing is they're setting up an altar for 2020 right now. I would say there's probably about three or four dozen people who are doing this. Um, and they're putting stuff on the altar to inspire them because now is not about manifestation. Now is about pre-planning. But they're creating this altar of beautiful things to inspire them for what they're going to create and build and, and energize next year. 
And so if you're doing a pre-planning or inspiration altar for 2020, that should be at the center of it is what I would say because peach moonstone is about, it's the, it's the most feminine expression of the moon. So it's, it's procreation and it's, it's gestation and it's imagination and all of those things together. I know. Um, what was the price on those? I can't remember. Those were <coughs> $375. $375. Original price on those was almost $600. Um, it's actually really hard to find peach moonstone in a generator over three inches or so. So to have it at eight inches, that was the largest that we, that's the biggest one we've ever seen. I can't. It's pretty. It's just, it's just pretty. Yeah. No, it's Moonstone. Anyway, congratulations. To get a Moonstone generator at eight inches for under $400 is like unheard of. It doesn't happen. So congratulations to you guys. Okay. All right. Blue Cow Sydney generator. Blue Cow Sydney. Let's do the winners for these. Kathy B. and Jen's pet care. Kathy B. and Jen's pet care. Congratulations. Cindy Nolan and Lee N. Cindy Nolan and Lee M. Suzanne R. and Lindsay W. Suzanne R. and Lindsay W. Lori L. and Nancy E. Lori L. and Nancy E. Um, Tress is saying there's no quad pay for live sales, but I was told that there is. If we were told that there is. Um, we can do some research into that and let them know before the end of the sale. Or let me yeah, can you send a message over? Um, that's not my understanding, Tress. So just before... Just before your comment sends people into a little bit of an anxious tizzy, I just want to clarify because my understanding is there absolutely is quad pay for live sales. We'll confirm it, you guys. Yeah, I yeah, and Cindy did it last time. I just gotta be careful because sometimes people will comment and say something, and it's it's. I want to correct that before we <laughs> before we move on because some of you are making purchases, and I don't want you to be nervous that you're not going to be able to use it. Yeah, they've all they all did it last time, so I think oh, I think so we're, we're good. good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Sorry about that. I just wanted to make sure I corrected that for you. Okay. Where okay. do we leave off? Um, Teresa V K and Denise G. Okay, Teresa V K and Denise G. Congratulations, you guys. Juju B and Ghost Nikki. Juju B and Ghost <laughs> Nikki. Congratulations. Candice M and Cindy R. Candice M and Cindy R. Carissa and Suzanne B. Carissa and Suzanne B. Congratulations, you guys. Karen C and Lee C. Karen C and Lee C. Joyce M and Skylar P. Joyce M and Skylar P. Michelle N and Inspire Light. Michelle N and Inspire Light. Congratulations. Martha R and Amanda R. Martha R and Amanda R. Cindy G and Amaya Nelson. Cindy G and Amaya Nelson. Congratulations, you guys. Karina M and Laurel T. Karina M and Laurel T. Um, Betty Wong and Deanna F. Betty Wong and Deanna F. Suzanne R. and Deborah S. Suzanne R. and Deborah S. Ali Trujillo and Denise Ann. Ali Trujillo and Denise Ann. Congratulations. Rinna O. and Rhonda L. Rinna O. and Rhonda L. Rinna and Rhonda. Renee H. and Ginger L. Renee H. and Ginger L. Greatness for Danielle and Wanderlust Musing. Greatness for Danielle. Oh, how beautiful. And Wanderlust Musing. I like that one, too. Jennifer H. and Delisa Dawn. Jennifer H. and Delisa Dawn. Congratulations, you guys. Enjoy. Like I said, same thing goes for you. 2020 visioning altar. Um, any space where you're sort of dreaming into being or imagining something into being, that's where you want this to go at the centerpiece, to raise the frequency for that so that you feel connected to the energy of it. Um, I will tell you, this: there's no more blue calcedony generators in the house. We had small and medium before Denver and then large after Denver, and that's all we have. So congratulations, you guys got the very last of probably the best inspiration stone you can work with. Next two, I would say Spessor Tight Garnet would be pretty powerful, but more expensive. Uh, and Peach Moonstone. Those are probably the three. Well, Botswana Agate is really good for inspiration, too. And Blue Lace Agate, which is, this is a combination of Blue Calcedony and Blue Lace Agate. Just in service of teaching you and, like, giving you the <laughs> breadth of options that you can use for creativity. Those are my favorites. Madeline Mullins is joining us from Norwich. How are you? Nice to see you this evening. How's it going in Connecticut? Is it beautiful there today? I hope so. Excited to see you guys. Okay. Okay. Shall we move on? Let's do it. Let's do this guy. Okay, let's do it. So we're going to show you some one-of-a-kind pieces now. 
Um, these are dream skulls that we have for you tonight. Very, very, very rare pieces. So we had quantum quattro skulls for you guys last year, or last month, I'm sorry. We had like, what was it, four of them? Yeah, but they were bigger and they only had a single skull. This was in the sh same shipment of them, the same delivery, the same um, um, container of them. Um, and this is the last one I think we have because we sold the other ones last week and then we have this one tonight. I I don't think we have any other quantum quattro skulls in the house. And by the way, the quantum quattro is an amalgam of four different minerals for healing, which includes shatakite and chrysocolla and smoky quartz and dioptes. Um, so this is the last of the kind, but it's a double. Isn't it beautiful? So the original price on this one was $7.50. Our price tonight is $4.99. To have the only, and I mean only, double quantum quattro skull ever. And I love that the back is natural, and there's actually a druzy pocket over here. Isn't that amazing? I mean, you will truly have the one of a kind ever, ever, ever of quantum quattro skulls. And then it's gone. I thought about keeping this one. I did, honestly, because I've never seen a double quantum skull like that but I also knew it wasn't for me. Somebody needs this healing. And you know, it's partly my job to make sure that the things go in the hands of the people who need it. <clears throat> oh, who got this one? Oh, it was Emily Flanders. Oh, Emily Flanders got it. That makes my heart happy. I am delighted for you, Emily. I really, truly am. It's so beautiful. I just wish you every healing with this piece. I'm getting that you're going to be using this for other people, um, for channeling and for wisdom and, and clients, and I think that's really beautiful. So my wish for you is that it delivers really clear and accurate messages that help you as a healer to support those who will receive that healing. Congratulations, you guys. Whew. That's awesome, Emily. Cheers, girl. I'm going to leave it right here, actually. I want him to look at me for a little while. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's fun for me to see, like, where these are supposed to go. You know? Like, I trust the process. We do have the ruby skull. I'll show you that one, too. I love him. I love him, too. There's only one of him. Um, so this is um, ruby and matrix. And uh, what's special about this skull, there's a whole story behind this skull. So there's a star ruby here. And he's got ruby down his face on the other side. Let me show you. When you, when you get this, whoever gets this one, take it outside because you'll see all the sparkles in that star. But he has ruby sort of cascading down his face. <clears throat> um, now this is zoocyte, but it's, it's a darker zoocyte. So it's almost a black. It's so incredibly beautiful. So the stone came from India, and they shipped it to Peru, and it was carved in Peru, okay? And they found this star ruby as they were carving. So they carved around it, you guys. That's what I think is so cool. There was only one of these. They only sent one piece of rough over, and they literally carved around his ruby. The, the retail value of this skull is $899. Our price is seven forty nine, and there's only one. And I will just tell you right now, I don't know a lot of people who have a star ribby skull. And I'm this isn't my first rodeo. Do you know what I mean? Like this is when I tell you something is really special. <laughs> I don't know who's gonna get this, but it's really something else. And it's beautifully carved too. The face is beautiful. There's a little ruby on his nose right here but I love how it sort of cascades down. The story of Ruby, by the way, is that when someone you love passes away, they transform into a Ruby and go on to live in your heart forever as part of your memories. Isn't that beautiful? So, he's for somebody. He's a good friend, but um, yeah, in my whole existence, never a star Ruby skull. In fact, nobody I've talked to has ever seen anything quite like that. Even the team is like, are you really going to sell that? So, but that's why these shows are so exciting. Oh, did Danny girl get it? Yay. <laughs> Janet's like, I got saved from buying him. <laughs> it's quite something. 
there's a um there's a companion energy like do you know how when you get a new pet like a new dog or a new cat and you just don't want to like leave them alone you don't want to go to work you don't want to go to the grocery store you just want to be with them all the time there's a little bit of like that with this like maybe and he's he's small enough he's heavy but maybe you could carry him with you for a little while get like a little gemstone baby bjorn and like <laughs> is that weird <laughs> no alexis is just like what <laughs> um bjorn is just a funny word. <laughs> uh well frankie so a lot of a lot of the show is is a mix of higher price and lower price things but because everybody knows this is like athena's favorite best things a lot of the things you're seeing tonight are more expensive but i do still have some things that are fairly affordable so stay tuned we're just showing you some of the things tonight are so one of a kind that to me they qualify as like near museum pieces you know what i mean like this piece in particular the ruby skull like the covalite skulls that i have for you tonight they just don't exist you know what i mean so partly i try to include those things but i also do try to bring in things that are a little bit more affordable you can tell that it wasn't just a star ruby, it was a record keeper ruby. Well, and it's a trapiche or yeah. trapiche too. It has the six points. It's just, it's absolutely, that skull is absolutely magnificent. <laughs> yeah, well, here's the thing. Like, some people, if there aren't really special, dreamy pieces, then they get disappointed. Like, show me stuff I've never seen and I'm never going to see again kind of thing. So I try to balance both for you guys. These are affordable. Yes, they are, and they're beautiful. Okay, here's a ring I love. So you're seeing these rings because I picked them. I, here's, and here's why, the intention behind these rings. And by the way, most of the rings that you're going to see from Sage Goddess, this is a new one that's on the website today, so this one is not adjustable. But most of the rings I bring you are adjustable. These are adjustable in 925 sterling. Um... And so I wanted a ring, and here's the intention, that would help you, if you're too deep into shadow work, to balance and come back into the light. Does that make sense? And so that's what this is. This is a stone of manifesting protection and light energy. It's dendritic agate, which is super rare. Less than 5% of all agate is dendritic. And then it's black tourmaline in quartz. Let me get it really close so you can see it. Black tourmaline and quartz, and then a Herkimer diamond with carbon inclusion, which is for physical healing. So this is out of the darkness into the light. Isn't it beautiful? So if you ever feel like you get too deep into your spiritual work or you, I don't know, can't find your way back, because my students are all about creating balance, right? Aren't they beautiful? So all of them have the same combination. Black tourmaline and quartz for protection and magnification. Dendritic agate for bringing yourself out of the depths and manifesting peace in your life. And then, um, and loving kindness too. And then Herkimer diamond, which is the highest vibrational quartz on the planet. Aren't they pretty? Yeah, all of them. I When I design a ring, they're open on the back. Because these are medicine pieces, and so you want the energy of those stones to be touching you. And all the pieces that I design are all 925, and then they're fully adjustable. So you can open that up to about a size 10, and you can close that down to about a size 4 or 4.5. Isn't that cool? What grade do I sell, Helen? I'm not sure I understand the question. Most of the stones are gem grade, but some of them are, are semi-precious, right? So it's, it's hard to sort of discern what the grading would be when you're looking at semi-precious stones. But we try to keep our prices for our rings at or about or under $100, and so it's a balance of wanting to find the, the nicest quality stones, but also keeping them in an affordable price range, too. So these are, what number is this one, Alexis? That is number 33 on the back. Okay. <laughs> so this one, retail value is 89. I have 30 of these. They are 69. For out of the darkness into the light rings. Aren't they beautiful? So, you know, if you're like me and you get bored, you could wear it on your ring finger one day and then you could wear it on your middle finger the next day and then you, do you know? Yeah, Helen, it all depends on the stones, sweetheart, unfortunately, because we do, I mean, I'm probably covering about 40 different stones in the gem shows, or the gem sale today, so it really depends on which stone I'm showing. And because we work with stones from all over the world, the, the grading, you know, sort of 
um, differs and depends on that too. Aren't they beautiful? I'm so glad you guys are excited about them. So yeah, so this will fit you whether you have a little teeny finger, like my pinky finger is a size three and a half or a four, all the way up to, like I said, about a 10. Totally different. And I love the combination because of what, what each one represents metaphysically. And you don't often see double terminated Herkimer diamonds in rings. And that's a, that's a transmitter of energy. It sends and receives energy both directions. Isn't it beautiful? Every ring that you see, I have sold at Sage Goddess at some point. This ring is on our website today. This ring was on our website last week. These are both custom made for me. This ring we had in a gem sale about three years ago. This ring was on our website last week. This one is a replica we had in a gem sale about three years ago. So if you love my jewelry, come to the sales. Other than my wedding ring, I pretty much have sold everything, <laughs> everything that I wear at some point kind of fun. I mean, I, I really only bring things to you that I love. If I don't love it, you're not going to see it here. And that citrine ring is absolutely beautiful. It's on sagegoddess.com. So congratulations. We'll come back and let you know. Now you want to do Ganesha's now? Um, well, April Bobier says, solar <coughs> gems in the rings, please. I will tell you, April, you will probably have to shop with someone else. I love you, but I, I, I only bring things I love, and I'm not a small gem girl. But there are plenty, I'm being candid, there are plenty of people who love smaller stones and you're probably going to have to shop with them. I, the, the stones in the sun meets the moon ring are the smallest I would probably bring you. Because I wouldn't wear a smaller ring and I don't bring you things that I wouldn't wear. <laughs> I just don't. But you know what, seriously, I mean there are people who really do a beautiful job of custom um, rings and smaller stones and so I think it's about finding your jeweler, you know what I mean? Just being authentic. I just, for me, I don't know what it is because I've got little tiny fingers. My biggest finger is a size six and a half, but I just love the big stones because I love the big energy. <laughs> Well, Candace, maybe it's time to start. We're going to do Kinesha's now. I think it's a good, a good call. Okay. We have, I will just tell you, we have nine of these. This was from Denver. And it was my hope and dream. <laughs> it's my hope and dream to find gemstone carved Ganesha's. I collect them, and they're really hard to find. There's only two times a year I can get them. And that's Denver and Tucson. Um, and so these are hand-carved out of almondine garnet. Now I'm going to show it to you, and I want you to imagine, as I bring it to the camera, the piece of rough that they would have to begin with to carve down to this, okay? Let me hold it up for you so you can see. The piece of rough that they would have to begin with to get down to that piece would be the size of your screen. The rest is loss. Does not that make sense? Count if you're on a phone. Yeah, not if you're on a phone. <laughs> so when I tell you the price, you'll understand how crazy it is. This is real garnet. This isn't like a red something. Do you know what I mean? It's hand carved out of garnet. Ganesha is the Hindu god of overcoming obstacles. He removes all the obstacles out of your past so that you can manifest, you can heal, you can experience joy. He removes grief and he removes failure and he removes fear and it's just I love working with Ganesha right so we have like I said we have nine I think I said nine of these yeah nine of these the original price was 118 our price tonight is $84 and I'm telling you there's no way we could ever bring it to you for less especially given that your shipping is included so if you would like a, gen a genuine garnet hand-carved statue of the Hindu god who removes obstacles from your path. This is it. And we don't have any more hand-carved Ganeshas, I don't think, coming for you before the holidays. So that's what I'm saying. Even if you're not thinking holiday yet, I would kind of be thinking holiday because a lot of the things that you're seeing now would be really cool holiday gifts and we just won't have them back before the holidays. Isn't that cool? Garnet, which is the most powerful grounding stone. It activates the root chakra and the earth star chakra to remind you that you're safe. Reminds me of what I was telling, teaching my students today about reminding your body that you're safe because we're talking about weight gain. 
And when you gain weight, it's because you're trying to create distance between yourself and other people, usually out of fear of being hurt. And so we were talking about how you have to train your body to not be afraid of people. And then you'll find that weight loss becomes much easier. Isn't that cool? Are you a wreck right now, Kathy? Well, sending you some sweet energy where you are. It's really true. We only hold on to weight when we're trying to create separation from other people. Through trauma, we, we do that through childhood experiences yeah so the more you can remind your mind body and spirit that you're safe and that people are safe it's safe to love it's safe to trust it's safe to open it's safe to connect then you'll find that even though you think you can't lose weight the weight sort of finds its way off it's true don fisher has a beautiful way of putting it she said reprogram the thought process but a lot of times it's not about what you're eating i have clients who are really overweight and they eat less than i do like they barely eat. Do you know people like that? And it's because every calorie they eat, their body is just holding on to it because they are afraid of people. And people are scary sometimes, let's be honest. More muggles, not like magical people. Yeah, the garnet is super magical. All right, congratulations, you guys. We'll come back and let you know who got those. Okay, what's next, Alexis? Hmm. Hmm. I saw some people asking about these ultimate smudge Yeah, let's bowls. show the smudge, <laughs> smudge bowls. Okay. So, these are the ultimate smudge bowls. Everybody keeps asking about my necklaces. I appreciate you guys. <laughs> I know. I mentioned it at the beginning. I um, I had beautiful ceremony all weekend with um, one of my teachers in ayahuasca medicine, and I don't wear any jewelry when I'm doing ceremony, so I haven't put it back on yet. I will. I just haven't done it so far. Okay. This is the largest smudging bowl ever. Okay. These bowls are handmade out of teak wood. These are made in, in Bali. And then inside, they poured in hand-hammered copper. Do you see? And we're sending it to you with a jumbo cedar bundle for grandfather medicine for releasing fear, a jumbo white sage bundle for releasing negative energy and low vibrations, a huge spear of selenite to bring white light into your sacred space, a large disc slice of palo santo wood for emotional and physical healing, a large piece of almondine garnet for grounding, and then a pinyon pine bundle which is for loving kindness and tenderness and ceremony. Isn't it beautiful? I mean, you could do anything you want with it, but we think it's like the best smudging bowl ever. Which one is this one, Alexis, on the list? That is number five. Okay, so this is the deal of the night because we're selling these for the price of the bowl. So the retail value of the bowl is 450. We're selling the whole thing tonight with the three bundles, the Palo Santo, the Selenite, and the Almondine Garnet for three fifty. So you're getting, what is that? I mean, a lot of goodies from us basically <laughs> for free. And it's heavy, so it ships for free. Isn't that cool? I mean, it's not so heavy that I can't hold it, but it's substantial. It's teak and copper. Um, this is the deal of the night. Like, hands down, I'm just telling you, try finding a copper bowl, forget a teak bowl, forget all the smudging tools. You just can't. It's the deal of the night. So if you've wanted sort of an ultimate smudging kit that will hold all of your smudging tools, and you can even add other bundles to it. You could, you know, put your charcoal in there and burn your herbs on there. There's no limit to what you can do with that. Isn't it beautiful? Congratulations. So we have five of those, and we'll let you know who got those. I kept one for myself, mm -hmm. and that's all she wrote. Isn't it gorgeous? I know. Super, super, super beautiful. Five. Just five of those. Sometimes we have one of things. Sometimes we have five of things. That one, we had five of things. Congratulations. And we almost never bring back anything. Because here's the thing, I think I have adult onset attention deficit disorder. Like, I'm undiagnosed, but I will tell you, I can't pay attention to very much for very long. 
And so I get bored. So the reason I never repeat things, like I'm creating custom jewelry, but when it sells out, I'm onto that. I've already designed three more things. So you're not gonna see old designs again. Plus we have this problem at Sage Goddess where people copy things. So as soon as I make something and somebody copies it, I go on and do something else. Cause then I get bored. I don't wanna see the same thing all the time. So if you say, oh, are you ever gonna bring this thing back? It's like, mm, probably not. If you've seen it here before, we probably won't bring it back. I don't think we've ever done a ring twice, have we? So far? Not in the gem Not in the gem sale. Mm -mm. No. <coughs> we've relisted stuff. On yeah, we relist things on the website, but not on the gem sales. Because what you're seeing tonight is like all my favorite stuff. You know what I mean? Like kind of the cream of the crop, and we don't repeat it. So if you're called to something, the rule with the gem sales is get it, because otherwise you'll, you'll miss it. You guys want to do more winners? What do you have ready to announce? Let's maybe the generators or the surprise bags, or we do the generators already. So the we surprise are, bags. We are ready, but I like announcing winners after big quantities. That okay. way it gives us time to yeah, get yeah, the winners. Yeah. So okay. let's do a big quantity, and then we can announce some winners. Okay, we'll do one more item, and then we'll then we'll do a winner. Let's do. How about angelite rings? Let's do angelite rings. I love it. Okay, I have a story to tell you about <clears> angelite. <throat> I'm gonna take one of my rings off so I can put this on and show you. Angel Light is the Stone of the Angels. I'll tell you how many we have of this. We have nine small and about two dozen large. So I'm going to show you the two different sizes. So this is the small Angel Light ring, and this is the large. Isn't it beautiful? So I'm going to teach you about it first. By the way, these are adjustable, open on the back, all done in 925 sterling silver. Same manufacturer who does all of our jewelry, so same quality, everything that you've come to know and love. Aren't they beautiful? I'm not going to tell you the price yet, Delia, because I want to <laughs> teach you about it first. <laughs> Once I tell you the price, you can buy it, and then people want to know about what the energy is first, so let me tell you that first. Okay. Um, when I was young, I lived in the Valley of Los Angeles for a little while. And up in Topanga Canyon, there was a place called Angelite Ohm. And they don't exist up there anymore. I think she moved to Hawaii. But she used to take Angelite and make tables out of it. And you could go into her little, she had a tent, a healing tent. And she had tables made of Angelite and you could lay on the tables. They were ascension tables. I wanted one so bad, but I mean, at the time it was like, forget it, right? <laughs> so expensive, but really worth it. Everything she made was by hand. And so one day I went in there and I was in graduate school at the time. So I went up and I was trying to relax and de-stress and I laid down on her angelite table. And I swear to you, all of the archangels gathered around that table while I was laying there. And I've never had a more profound angelic experience in my life literally is the embodied form of all of the archangels Michael and Raphael and it was just it was so incredibly beautiful and each one was sort of explaining to me what their particular energy stream or vibration was and so that's when I fell in love with Angelite and I asked her why before I went into the to her little healing room I asked her why she worked with Angelite and she said because it attracts the angels and so I went in and laid down and had my own lived experience of that We've never had angelite rings for you before. Um, the small size, the retail price is 62. Our price is 49 tonight. I only have nine. Small angelite rings, aren't they sweet? This would be a really cute pinky ring too. And then of the large, the retail price is $76. Our price is $59. And I have two dozen of the large. And that's it. And that was that was all of the angelite that was available to make rings. So it's, it's, even though it's a stone that you see from time to time, it's not a stone that you commonly find in jewelry. So if you're trying to work with the angels, especially the archangels, you know, those big energy streams of protection and communication and wisdom, if you're really trying to call in those higher order angelic energies, and, it, and for those of you who wanted smaller rings, and I was sort of laughing with you because I'm not a small ring girl, um, that sort of qualifies, doesn't it? Like, <laughs> I'm not a good person to ask. <laughs> I'm not a good judge. Like, because I just, the, for me, that it's like go big or go home. But um, this sort of qualifies as a small ring, right? <laughs> I 
don't know. <laughs> Aren't they beautiful? I know. Oh, thank you, Mandy Smith. What a cutie pie you are. She said it's her first live chat with our group, and she's happy to be here. We're happy to have you here. And congratulations. So is it is it not a small gemstone? I don't know. See, I told you I'm a shitty judge of that. The small ones are small. But that's small by sage goddess standards, though. That's yeah. not small by, like, human standards. There's little stones in some of my rings. I just like it big. We've been so naughty tonight. And not intentionally. We've been trying to really behave ourselves, actually. Okay. We'll come back and let you know. So you guys want to do... Let's do some winners. <laughs> Let's do winners. I want to keep this on my pinky. It actually feels really nice there. So I know we want to talk about surprise bag winners. Let's do surprise bag winners. So that is going to <coughs> Diane L. and Annette C. Diane L. and Annette C., you guys are winners of the surprise bags of for ancestral wisdom. Congratulations, you guys. Scarlett and Lindsay W. Scarlett and Lindsay W., congratulations. Carissa and Brianna N. Carissa and Brianna N., congratulations. Rhonda L. and Michelle P. Rhonda L. and Michelle P. Cindy N. and Emma R. Cindy N. <laughs> and Emma R. Cindy B. and April B. Cindy B. and April B. Katie B. and Denise Ann. Katie B. and Denise Ann. I thought it was going to be all B's for a minute. <laughs> Naya Ree and Crystal M. Naya Ree and Crystal N. Congratulations. Ooh, Raven Ninjetta. Raven Ninjetta. It's an intimidating <laughs> profile name. I like it, though. I like it. And Rinna O. And Rinna O. Natasha G. <laughs> Natasha, Nat Natasha G. Natasha G. And Denise C. And Denise C. Delina S. and Roxanne B. Delina S. and Roxanne B. Melissa L. and Suzanne B. Melissa L. and Suzanne B. Michelle, Michelle N. and Ashley B. Michelle N. and Ashley B. Cassie T. and Delisa Dawn. Cassie T. and Delisa Dawn. Joyce M. and Juju B. Joyce M. and Juju B. Norma Fig and Karen C. Norma Fig and Karen C. <laughs> Debbie M. and K. Grand. Debbie N. and K. Grand. Congratulations, you guys. Cynthia D. and Steph K. Cynthia D. and Steph K. Yvonne S. and Renee H. Yvonne S. and Renee H. Marcy D. and Lore A. Marcy D. and Lore A. Heather Y. and Dawn F. Heather Y. and Dawn F. Starlight, Starlight Insight. Oh, and, I like that. Starlight Insight. And NV3. And NV3. Congratulations. Jean K. and Jen K. Jean K. and <laughs> Jen K. Lee C. and Ginger L. Lee C. and Ginger L. Is that Lee's like the French no, name Lee's? I'm like, sorry. It's, a, it's Lee Cummings. Oh, Lee so Cummings. I was trying to say Lee Lee C, not Lee, <laughs> Lee's. There's a beautiful French name, Lee's. Okay, Lee C, Lee Cummings. Hi, Lee. And Ginger L. And Ginger L. Martha R. and Tiffany Woods. Martha R. and Tiffany Woods. Those are the congrat the uh, the surprise bag winners. Congratulations, you guys. Ancestral wisdom is coming your name, coming your way. I'm reading the comments, and I I'm kind of like tracking you guys. I love it. Do you ever notice how, like, the community, they chit-chat with each other? Like, it's really mm -hmm. super cute. I love that you guys do that. Uh, congratulations, you guys. <laughs> Denise is like, poor Alexis. <laughs> we do our best. We, you know, it's, it's, uh, trying to win, to announce all the winners and make sure all of your, your last initials are in there, too. Gray of Entry and Spheres, we'll come back to in just a couple minutes. We're going to do a winner and then move into more products, then we'll come back and do a winner for you again. Okay. Black tourmaline spheres, you want to do that? Yes. Okay. These are the largest black tourmaline spheres we've ever had. These are from Denver. Go ahead now. And then just let me, oh, here they are. Okay, we have small, medium, and large. I only have five total. Whoever gets the big one, like, you like big balls and you cannot lie. Oh, that's sweet, Julie. We love that. Okay. <clears throat> um, we have had black tourmaline spheres for you before, but not this size and not these prices. Um, so this isn't something we'll ever be able to do for you again. This was just a really fun surprise. 
I'm going to show you really quickly. Ready? <coughs> this is the most protective stone on the planet. It comes with a stand ready for you to go. You ready? This is the small, 4.25 inches. Um, the retail price on this is 300. Our price tonight is 225. Small. There's only one. 225 for this size of black tourmaline sphere is insane. Okay, I mean it's insane. We have three of the medium. The retail price is 275. Our price is 250, and we have three. 4.5 inches to 4.75 inches. This should be $400. I mean, this is basically a wholesale price for you guys tonight. I don't even know how we're doing it, okay? Yeah, this is the small. I don't even, we can't, I don't even know why we're calling that a small. It shouldn't be, because for us in the past, I mean, candidly, this would have been XXXXL. Yeah. Our small used to be like that, okay? We should be calling them extra large, extra, extra large. We're not going to, because I'd be confused what to say. <laughs> Barely lift this one. <laughs> this is the large. It's 5.5 inches. The retail price is 625. Our price is 550. That's insane. I remember having one back in the day about this size for 250. So I, I don't even know how many multiples that is. Whoever gets the, the you're just lucky tonight. These are just really incredible and especially the large. If nobody wants the large, I'll keep it because we don't even have one in the house that big. It's a steal for black tourmaline. Isn't it incredible? So congratulations, whoever gets those. I'm super curious to see who gets them though because that is like, and I just, like I'm telling you, I don't want to disappoint you, but we'll never have this size at this price again. We just, honestly, that's us passing savings along to you guys. Aren't they beautiful? <laughs> So we'll come back and let you know who got those. There's only five. I don't. I don't want to look just yet. I want to. I don't. I, it's like a fun surprise for me too. So I'm not going <laughs> to look and see who got those yet. Okay. Um, I'm going to show you the covalite skulls. Okay. Um, this is like beyond collector. Okay. I have five <coughs> of these. There were six. I'm keeping one. So here's what I want you to know. Covalite comes from Peru. This is the rarest and most potent third eye stone on the planet. I'm a collector. I have very little, even after trying to collect for years. I have a heart, I have a sphere, and I have a couple of small tumbled pieces, and now I'm keeping one of the skulls. So this is the person who mines the covalite, was the one who cut it into the skulls, okay? So that's very rare to find someone who has the rough, who actually carves it, and who manufactures it. Um, these don't exist anywhere in the world. We tried to find them online. I mean, they just don't exist, but that's because we brought them directly from the source, okay? The retail value on these, if they were going to be out there on the marketplace, is $1,500. 1500. Our price tonight, and anyway, we only have five, and by the way, he's not carving skulls ever again. It was too hard, um, is 900 for the five meaning each one is 900. Okay. <laughs> um, one, of the, one of the rarest things I've ever showed you in our time together, do you see that blue color, how it's like an iridescent blue? That's natural. Um, I'm gonna be doing visioning work with this one. This is higher order. I mean, if you're trying to awaken psychic gifts, clairvoyance, clairaudience, clairsentience, clairgustance, clairalliance, whatever the psychic gifts are, I'm just saying, I see a lot of things in the work that I do never in my life and I sincerely so I know it's expensive but this is definitely for those of you who are like I have everything <laughs> you know what I mean like I've got one of that I've got one of that I've got one of that you don't have a covalent skull so this will be for certain people and not for other people and if it's not your medicine great like leave it for the people who do need it because there are people in the community who do need to plug in to some bigger ancestral channel of, of wisdom and insight. And that's part of the work that I'm doing too right now. This is going home. So this is the actual one that I'm keeping because it's the least nice of the six. 
which might sound funny to you, but I always ask to be given the least nice because I don't want, I want, when you guys get yours, I actually want it to be prettier than what I've shown you. So this is the one I'm keeping because he has a little bit of brown on his face. <laughs> I think it builds character when they have flaws and things that are not, you know, but I want you guys to have ones that, you know, have mostly blue. Does it just look black to you, really, Amy? Can you guys see it, the blue on your computers as I'm showing it? I just want to make sure you guys I, can I see it. See it. Yeah, I okay, see good. It. it looks black to Amy. I'm hoping that it looks blue to you guys because it really is this, like, it's natural. That's not, like, titanium or aura treatment at all. But, I mean, we can try putting my flashlight on it. Maybe that'll make it It looks blue on my screen, but, yeah, again, I maybe you guys are seeing it. something that I'm not seeing. <laughs> True. Isn't it beautiful? Pretty amazing, isn't it? So, anyway, not for everybody. Collector's edition. But that's what these gem sales are about, so I wanted you to see it. So can you see it? Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Nope, he's mine. <laughs> A little bit too big for the bra. It looks like, I know, it is, it's like a midnight blue. Isn't it beautiful? Mm-hmm. Okay, we'll come back and let you know who got those two. Um, I want to show them the Garnerite and Moonstone if I can. Absolutely. Um, Garnerite. So I cherry picked each one of these. We have how many of these? Three. Yeah, there they are. Okay. These are from Denver. I picked each one by myself. And it was late at night. And the next day I was like, Dave, go back and pick those up. <laughs> like I picked the ones I wanted. These are the largest Garnerite and Moonstone generators you will ever find okay um garnerite is the green do you see that sort of like neon green color and that's a result of nickel and nickel is a very healing mineral for the heart this is and and moonstone of course is a stone of manifestation and fruition and completion so all of this is moonstone all the matrix is moonstone and it actually has like kind of a chatoyancy or a light play when you get it out in daylight and then the green is all garnerite so this is a really unique combination um, and this one has black tourmaline you see right there <coughs> Right on the little nose of it has black tourmaline because garnerite and moonstone grow with black tourmaline. So there's a little bit of protection medicine in there too. Okay. This is transformation of the heart. Um, this is someone who's trying to love again after being really hurt. This is someone recovering from childhood trauma, right? Maybe heart chakra challenges from early, early, early in life. Um, the retail value of pieces this size, they don't exist, by the way. These are, again, the largest garnerite and moonstone generators coming out of Madagascar. So the retail value is $1,400. Our price is $800. But I only have three. These are 16 inches of heart healing magic. Just magic. Um, what's really interesting about garnerite, so the person who mines it was telling me this story. Isn't it amazing? Yeah, I mean, rejection medicine, um, trauma medicine, any kind of wounding coming out of relationship is what this particular combination is for. There's a certain amount of, like, bravery energy that comes with garnerite. It's hard to describe. Nickel is very... Um, Nickel solidifies the energy field. It reintegrates the energy field, and it activates the heart chakra. And then Moonstone is about transformation and fruition, like completion of cycles. So if you're trying to let go of early childhood grief or loss, this is a really good combination for you to work with. You'll find Garnerite sometimes without the Moonstone or with very little Moonstone in the matrix, part of what I loved about the three. And they had about six or eight. Um, but I chose these three because of the amount of Moonstone. And when you get this, you have to take it out into the light and you will see the shimmer. I might be able to show you here. This is one side that has the rainbowing in it. I don't know if, you, if I can get it to play for you guys. But you'll be able to see a little bit of the magic as I turn it maybe. It's a little bit. So you'll see the, like how, that, how the moonstone in there, or the rainbows in there comes to life. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, you can kind of see it there. It's dancing for you a little bit. It's way more in person. Isn't it gorgeous? 
Um, if you're allergic to nickel, no, because this is, you have to realize this is mineralized in matrix. So I don't think you're going to have an allergic reaction the way you would to putting a nickel ring on. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Which is oxidized and combined with other metals. So I don't think you're going to have an allergic reaction if you're allergic to nickel working with garnerite. I haven't heard of that before, and I have heard of people who are allergic to nickel working with it. Isn't it interesting? It's so beautiful. So you'll know, and I think it's really good to use your discernment. Some stones call to us, and what I've noticed too, and I was teaching my students this last week, I'm always called to stones about six months before I need them. Like maybe you're supposed to awaken your psychic gifts right now because you're gonna need them. Maybe you're supposed to be healing your heart right now because you're going to need to open your heart. You know what I mean? Like sometimes you don't know why you're called to something before you need it, but you end up that way. Isn't it beautiful? And it's, it's this neon green. I'm telling you guys that like you don't often see that color of bright neon green. And here's what's interesting. So the person who mines this told me a story about how they, they go every year to mine uh, garnerite. Certain years in garnerite's formation... It, it will disintegrate. If it doesn't form in the matrix accurately, they'll go in and there'll be no garnerite because it's unstable on its own. So it finds its stability in its matrix. It's vulnerable and tender until it gets into that moonstone matrix and that's what causes it to harden and get strong. And it's kind of like us too. On our own, we can be vulnerable, right? And, and tender and easily broken. But when we find our combination with the right matrix that supports us and nourishes us, then we find our strength and we're able to regenerate again. Isn't that amazing? It's so good. <laughs> it's good medicine for that, for sure. Okay, we'll come back and let you know who got those two. All right. Where do you want to go, Alexis? How about these? Oh, yes. Okay. This is big medicine for you guys, okay? Big med for some of you, not for all of you. Um, I have a certain number of clients, and that's why I bought these, who tell me that no matter what they do, they can't manifest prosperity. And we have a hunch that for some people, they can't manifest prosperity because they either took a vow of poverty in a past life or something in their ancestral line prevents them from manifesting it. Um, I come from an immigrant lineage in this lifetime, and immigrants never think they're going to be able to make money or keep money. They're always afraid, because usually immigrants have lost everything. <laughs> As I drop the pendant. Um, and a lot of my own magical work has been about releasing those old patterns, because they don't serve me, and they don't probably don't serve you either. Right? Okay. I have, before I tell you about it, I only have seven of these. So I should tell you that first. These are natural citrine hearts with an ammonite on top. The ammonite, and we're going to show you a couple of forms of ammonite tonight. Ammonite comes from North America, Europe, and Africa. Ammonites are a minimum 60 to 70 million years old. That's this right here. These were little creatures 60 to 70 million years ago that have fossilized. And they form in the Fibonacci sequence, which is a mathematical sequence associated with manifestation and creation. That, that spiral is seen in your DNA. It's seen in plants and flowers and obviously in these little genetic creatures. Then you have the heart below it, which is natural citrine. It's open on the back. So these are for manifesting prosperity. Ancient prosperity which means letting go of karmic patterns that tell you that you can't manifest prosperity because your ancestors didn't, because you don't know how, because you took a vow of poverty, because, 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 right? Yeah, so the person who made these only made the seven. They're all done in sterling silver. It's got a nice big bail on it too, so you can fit that on any pendant that you have. Isn't it beautiful? So I have the seven of these. They are retail value 99. Our price is 74. And I love that the citrine is super chunky. Like I'll show you from the side. This is a really dimensional piece too. Isn't that beautiful? If you're kicking some old habits, like saying that you don't have enough or you won't have enough or you can't create enough, then this is your amulet. And every time you look at it, you're going to remember 
that that stuff is old. That's lineage stuff. It doesn't apply to you anymore. The rules are different now. You can manifest. You do have enough. You are worthy. <laughs> you know, there's more than enough available for you. This is the coaching I do with my students all the time because they have to break those old patterns and those old patterns are mental. But manifestation is mental. I'm coaching somebody right now and I can't get her to stop saying things that are undermining her ability to manifest. And even though I'm telling her consciously, stop saying these things, I turn around, she says it again. She's so stuck. But it's old and it's her grandmother stuff and her great grandmother stuff and her, you know, nine times grandmother stuff. It's generations back. But if you don't do the work of re architecting and redesigning and recreating your reality now, then you're gonna be stuck in these patterns for generations to come, right? <clears throat> It's really true. <coughs> so congratulations. We'll let you know who got those two. Is it winter time? Oh, don't forget my bracelet. I don't know if this is still available, oh, but yeah. this is honestly, this is, is that oh, did it sell? Oh, okay. I was going to say this is like, I went to Katana. Katana got this mm -hmm. out of all the bracelets I've shown you over the last two years. Maybe I'm telling you this because I kept the other one. I love it so much. Mm -hmm. This is one of the best bracelets ever. So congratulations, Katana. In terms of, like, manifesting prosperity, the rutilated quartz and this bracelet from tonight are pretty much all you need. That pendant would just be a party bonus. Okay. Lena has to leave soon, so she would like us to do the chakra wands. Darling Lena, we will do the wands for you. I kind of like it when you guys ask because we really do try to make you happy and make sure you see things in time. Okay, this is another one um, custom made for us. Will not be back before the holidays. I have 12 of each. These are chakra alignment wands. They're the same um, in terms of the uh, metal work and the stone work, but the double terminated wand underneath, you have your choice of clear quartz or rose quartz. Okay, do you see that? On the front, you have peridot for abundance, three stones that represent the upper world, lower world, and middle, or lower world, middle world, and upper world. Then you have rainbow moonstone for manifestation and fulfillment. You have um, amethyst for crown chakra connection, spirit connection. The rose quartz has the two garnets here. The clear quartz just has the two peridot. <coughs> so it's a slight difference, but they both have rainbow moonstone on the other side. And then the seven chakra stones. So amethyst for crown chakra, iolite for third eye, blue topaz for throat chakra, peridot for your heart chakra, natural citrine here for the solar plexus chakra, carnelian for the um, uh, sacral chakra, and then you have garnets for the root chakra down the front. Aren't they beautiful? You can activate grids with this. You can send and receive energy. This is a super good size to travel with, by the way. So if you do a lot of traveling healing work, you're going to love this one. You're not going to believe the price. The original price on these was $149. Our price tonight is only $99. <coughs> That's insane. <laughs> okay. $99. But I only have 12 of the rose quartz and 12 of the clear quartz, and that's it. And again, nothing like this before the holidays. What a gift to give someone. Can you imagine? It looks like a three or four or five hundred dollar wand at least. So to have that be under a hundred dollars because your shipping is included in the US, like Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Yule, <laughs> all the things. Mm hmm. They're beautiful, you guys. The quality of the stones and the metalwork is absolutely exquisite. This is an heirloom piece that you'll pass down, and someone will be super stoked to get this from you one day. Isn't that beautiful? If you were bold, you could attach a bale and wear it. Um, no, they are the same size. The clear quartz looks like a little wider around in terms of its dimension, but the rose quartz to carve is more expensive than the clear quartz, so they're the same length but the rose quartz is slightly slimmer around, if that makes sense. But they're, they're both typically the same size. But the rose quartz is slightly longer by about an eighth or a quarter of an inch, but then it's a little bit slimmer. So weight-wise, they're the same. 
Do you love that Merlinite mm -hmm. wand? I'm trying to get more wands made for you guys because everybody wants custom wands. We're, we're thinking about doing that for next year because I'm bringing Pillars of Priestessing back in 2020. You heard it first. That was a, that was a directive from ayahuasca this weekend. And there are to be wands made. Now I'm like, okay, so let me figure out how to do that. <laughs> so congratulations to the winners. We'll let you know, yes. In addition to Soul Shift, that will be coming back in 2020. Okay, winners. Dendritic agate rings. Dendritic agate rings. Let's talk about them. <clears throat> they went to Sandy B. Oh, I have and... one on. What? Okay, oh. no, it's okay. No, oh. They know. This is the coming out of the shadow into the light rings, right? Sandy B and Debbie M. Sandy B and Demi Debbie M. Congratulations, you guys. Norma Fig and Deanna F. <laughs> Norma Fig and Deanna F. I'll let you guys know what Pillars of Priestessing is in a minute. Some of you don't know, so. Skylar P and Lori K. Skylar P and Lori K. Congratulations. Inspire Light and Bridget O. Inspire Light and Bridget O. Cindy N and Yvonne Scott. Cindy N and Yvonne Scott. Congratulations. Candace M and Carolyn M. Candace M and Carolyn M. Christine G and Janet. Christine B and Janet. Congratulations, you guys. Kelly B and Ghost Nikki. Kelly B and Ghost <coughs> Nikki. <coughs> Natalie D and Nyree. Natalie D and Nyree. Scarlett and Jody S. Scarlett and Jody S. Congratulations, you guys. Mercy H and Nicole R. Mercy H and Nicole R. Lori K and Juju B. Lori K and Juju B. Lee C. <laughs> Lee Cummings and Marcy Diaz. Lee Cummings and Marcy Diaz. Congratulations. Lafon and Dot L. Lafon and Dot L. Amaya and Tia. Amaya and TM, congratulations. Yes, there are three new Oracle decks coming, and I'm working on three new books. And Pillars of Priestessing will be coming out as a book, so as I'm teaching it, I'll be completing the book, and that'll be coming out. And Pillars of Priestessing will be separate from Soul Shift, um, because not everybody who's interested in Soul Shift will be interested in Pillars of Priestessing, so that will be a separate. You can do everything together, but it will be separate. And more of a, a monthly meeting and then a quarterly high ceremony for Pillars of Priestessing. So Pillars of Priestessing, if you don't know, I was a professor of leadership for 10 years. Um, I taught graduate students, so I taught masters and MBA and doctoral students leadership, mostly people in the private sector. And so when I was started to teach priestessing, I realized really what priestessing is is spiritual leadership. And so I taught in a year-long class called the Pillars of Priestessing, which will become a book at the end of this year. And so I taught it one time, but I've grown and developed so much that my spirit guides want me to do a volume two, which is the evolution, my evolution of the Pillars of Priestessing. And so I'm, this, this will be the last time I teach Pillars of Priestessing in 2020. And then the book will come out and we'll focus on on that like that. So Pillars of Priestessing will get will be separate from Soul Shift, um, which are my online classes. So, but it's optional. You don't have to do Pillars of Priestessing. You can just do Soul Shift next year. Um, yeah, and then I'm I'm writing three different Oracle decks right now. They're almost done. So those are getting ready to go to print. There's a Gemstone Flashcard deck. There is a Manifestation deck. And there is a deck called Pearls of Wisdom, which are all of my little one-liners that you guys love. And then I have a relationship book that I'm working on. I have my Pillars of Priestessing book that I'm working on. And then I have a new uh, book on gemstones coming out, uh, probably at the end of 2021. <laughs> so I've been busy in my spare time. I teach online classes. So if you ever want to learn more about that, you can go to sagegoddess.com. And under classes, you'll find information about classes, too. And classes next year are all on FlexPay. There'll be an annual option, and you, you can use your FlexPay for the annual option, which is kind of nice, too. And the prices of classes aren't going up next year, but Pillars of Priestessing will be um, an addition to Soul Shift. So if you want to do that, there'll be a slightly different fee for Pillars of Priestessing, but not that much, actually. Yeah, and anyone can take it. Bless you. Um, <laughs> I don't sleep, actually, but I have a lot of energy. <laughs> Okay. All right. Oh, God. I feel like I have to put this on my head. <laughs> you. You. <coughs> yeah. So if you're in Soul Shift this year and you just want to continue Soul Shift, very little will change except that the curriculum's evolving and becoming more dynamic and interactive. So I think you guys will enjoy that. 
<laughs> it's super good because the annual option gives you like a whole month free and then to be able to separate that into payments is really exciting. I wish that when I took classes I, could, I had FlexPay, but unfortunately the people I work with don't know what FlexPay is or have that as an option. <laughs> okay. Um, I have two of these. I screwed it up. Which side is... What did you screw up? Oh, yeah, it's, it's a little bit lopsided. Do you want it down? Just or? even. I don't know. That's better. Okay. That's not that bad. <laughs> That's kind of bad. <laughs> is it kind of a priestess headpiece? <laughs> um, what you know about programs right now is all I know. I'm still downloading, and so when we have an official announcement about programs and pre-registration and all of that, I will let you know. So stay tuned. It'll probably be after November 1st because my team has to wrap their head around <clears throat> everything I just got downloaded from my journey. And then we have to work on all of that and then bring it to you in a convenient way. But yeah, if you've been in my programs this year and you just want to stay with the status quo, pretty much nothing's going to change for you. But if you want like the big enchilada or if you want a littler enchilada, that's where your options are changing. Okay. Because there'll still be an easy way to work with me at a lower price if you just want to work with me for like an hour a month. But we'll tell you more about that in a couple of weeks. Okay. This is our multi-gem situation. This is, I feel like I have to show you my head, which is really awkward. <laughs> is this weird? So there's citrine. Um, there's green amethyst, which is praiseolite. So citrine is for prosperity. Hold on. Wait a minute. This is really weird. I'm going to point at all the wrong things. There's smoky quartz for protection, there's green amethyst for physical healing, there's purple amethyst for spirit connection, and then there's citrine for abundance. And it goes all the way around, and it's adjustable. <laughs> Tasha, I don't know, sweetheart, so stay with me. I, um, I'm still channeling and figuring out what that needs to look like. I got this whole download from ayahuasca that, that, no, one need, <coughs> that no one needs Reiki anymore. Is that weird? I mean, I, I don't mean to undermine, but she was just saying that Reiki energy is now universally available. <laughs> so I don't know what that means. So I'm still asking and I'll, I'll let you know. But she was like, Reiki is not where you where what people need. If they want Reiki, they can universally access it. And it's not something that has to be taught anymore. Particularly by you. It's interesting, right? Yeah. I mean, I'm already attuned at master level, so I guess it's already coming through. But she was like, Reiki? Like, why would you have to include that? They already have it. And it's like, no, they think they don't. <laughs> I'm just saying. So don't judge me yet. I don't know what that's about, but I'm still listening. Okay. Um, <coughs> we uh, we have two of these. The retail value is 460 Our price is 349 for your All the Things necklace. Isn't that beautiful? So protection and transmutation, prosperity, physical healing, and spirit connection. And this goes, I mean, I'm wearing it on my head, which is maybe weird to you. You could certainly be like a normal person and put it around your neck, which is what it's meant for. It'd be a little small around your waist if you wanted to waist chain it. Maybe if you're super teeny, you could do that. <laughs> I like to wear it as a headband. I just think it's kind of fun. So, um, but it's got, I mean, I, I like that there's four different stones too with four different energies. And if you think about it, they kind of align to the four directions. So there's a balancing of the energies that happens with a necklace like this. So there's two of them, 349 a piece for your all the things necklaces. The total carat weight is something like 32 carats of cut and faceted gemstones, which is pretty good to get that for under $350. So there's two of those. And congratulations, we'll let you know. Anybody want it? <laughs> you want the one that's on my head? I will make a note of that. <laughs> okay. And then I want to show you these, these um, Vivianite, this Vivianite jewelry I have for you really quickly. This is important. Is that okay to do that next? Yes. Okay. I only have 22 Vivianite pendants. These are the largest we've ever had at the most amazing price. Okay. Um, no, caught yet. We don't pick order, uh, winners randomly. It's in order of their comment. Um, but sometimes it might look different to you than it looks to us. So bear with us, but we, we time it by when the comment came in. It's not, you know, 
it's not like who we think should have it or it's kind of some random process. When I do giveaways, which I'm about to do next, then it is. <laughs> then I let spirit sort of guide. Uh, no, no, that's why I'm saying don't, don't judge me on the Reiki comment. I'm just telling you what ayahuasca told me, that I don't need to teach it to you because what I can do is open a channel and that Reiki energy is universally available. It doesn't mean that your attunements are void. Like, you got a lot of magic out of that. It just means she was telling me I don't need to teach it. Do you know what I mean? But, I mean, those of you working with it, it's profound energy and very, very, very healing. And so I don't want to undermine your, your faith in it. She was just saying that it's not something that I need to teach. It's just accessible if you want to access Reiki energy. Yeah, I'm, I'm working on something else is what I would say. <laughs> okay. Um, I have <coughs> six of the large pendants. I'm sorry, seven of the large pendants, and I have 15 of the small. You guys are not going to believe these. Wait till I show you. Um, the large look like this, and they're all slightly different. So this is Vivianite. Vivianite is the self-healing stone, okay? And when you cut Vivianite, it heals itself. It actually changes color. And so Vivianite is the stone that allows you to self-heal, which is why everybody in my community wants it. We had single stone Vivianite pendants on sagegoddess.com last week, and they sold out so fast, okay? Um, so this is Vivianite with Iolite, like this particular piece, Iolite, and then it has uh, blue kyanite, and this is aquamarine. This piece has Vivianite with kyanite and aquamarine, but this, this, the sort of the order of the stones and the, and the whether it's cut faceted or polished are all different. This one has green amethyst with iolite stones and then Vivianite stones. Do you see that? And they're all open on the back. Aren't they incredible? So this is the size large. I have seven of these. The retail value is $4.99. Our price tonight is $3.25 for these pendants. And I will tell you something, they should be $4.99. So this is the large. I wish I had more of these too. So if you're trying to do balancing work, self-healing work, alignment work, this is one of the most beautiful pieces I've ever brought you. And there's no more of these. Isn't it beautiful? So Vivianite is this blue-green stone. When you cut it, it heals to either more blue or more green. I'm just showing you kind of all of the different variations. Aren't they stunning? This is a statement piece. For those of you who want smaller jewelry, like this is definitely not up your alley. <laughs> Save this for your brothers and your sisters who like the bigger pieces. Aren't they gorgeous? Okay, and then I have small, that's the large. Then I have small, I have 15 of the small. Retail price was 275 on these. Our price is 225. This is the small. Vivianite, green amethyst, kyanite, iolite. Balance, physical healing, vision, and healing, self-healing. And this one has, each one is slightly different. You've got iolite, green amethyst, kyanite, more green amethyst, and then the vivianite. Aren't they beautiful? And you can do your homework and your price comparing. I would encourage you to, although we don't have a lot, they'll be gone. You just will not find Vivianite with Kyanite and Iolite at prices like this. It's insane. I don't even know how we're doing it. But this is another case where we're just passing savings along to you guys. So if you're doing any kind of healing work, especially self-healing work, medical mediumship work, this is a really important piece. Or giving it as a gift to someone who's doing that work. Because it's, it's perfectly beautiful medicine uh, jewelry open on the back. Aren't they gorgeous? It's funny, your comments about Reiki are making me think, well, I could just put it into the curriculum. <laughs> so funny. Aren't they beautiful? I know, they're so stunning. So that's all I have for Vivianite. And then I have two uh, different <coughs> earrings. I have nine <laughs> pairs total of Vivianite. So if you want to complete your collection, 
we have, for the first time ever, sterling silver Vivianite earrings, and these are so beautiful. So these are, again, green amethyst, iolite, and Vivianite. They were made exactly to match your, your necklace. And these are original price $149. Our price on the earrings for the pair is $99. Isn't that beautiful? So, so, so beautiful. I only have one ear that I can wear earrings in, so I never put the pair on just because it always looked like I'm topsy-turvy. <laughs> yeah, here's the thing. You can get attuned to Reiki almost anywhere. There are Reiki, like online Reiki attunement places for like $20. But you know what I can do is teach you how to work with Reiki energy. Because you can get attuned almost anywhere, right? But then I can teach you how to navigate it and how to channel it. Maybe that's more where I go. Ayahuasca just seemed to suggest that it's already in your hands. All you have to do is allow it. I'll tell you something, ayahuasca doesn't like the idea that there are things that are off limits to people because all energy is available at all times, but no energy before it's time. You know what I mean? It's very interesting. But this idea, we have this very human idea of like, I don't know if it's all legit, but it's everywhere, you know? I work with Reiki energy all the time, but I just feel like those who have it can attune to it and don't. We always think we need somebody to attune us to it. And I guess that's what I'm feeling the resistance to. Like, do you really need someone to attune you or is this something that you can connect to, you know? And she's saying that's newer. Like in the past, people have needed a channel to connect to it, but we're, our whole planet, I don't know if you realize, maybe you feel it, our whole planet is going through an ascension process. And as our personal frequencies increase and as the planetary frequencies increase, codes are being unlocked for energy that were previously locked. Does that make sense? Because, I mean, I, I probably paid two or $3,000 to be attuned myself back in the day. Probably close to 3000 across my attunements. But she's just saying that we're at an ascension level now where we can access it. Like, I guess after what I heard from her, I would feel bad charging for that. If that makes sense? Something like that. It's universally accessible. Okay. Those earrings are so beautiful. Is there anything else you wanted to go through? Oh, we have the we have two more generators to show you. Do you guys still have an appetite to see some beautiful things? And we'll come back and do Wait, winners. Let's do, a winner let's do winners. Then, yeah, let's do winners. Yes, okay. Yeah. And okay. then after winners, we still need to do our giveaway and charity too. Oh. Actually, let me start there. Hold on just a second. Let me well, start there. Can well, I do that really quick? Let, let's give Hannah a little break and do some winners, and then we'll we'll go over there. Okay. To the to the giveaway. Yeah. Okay. To the giveaway. So the giveaway's next. You guys want to do winners now? Yeah. Let's okay. Do okay. Okay. What are we announcing? So, um, the angelite ring. Yes, that's what they want to know. Okay. <coughs> angelite ring winners. The small went to Crystal M and Sandy B. Crystal M and Sandy B. Lori K and Vicky M. Lori K and Vicky M. Congratulations, you guys. Cindy N and Norma Fig. Cindy M and Norma Fig. Laura Ash and Lisa C. Laura Ash and Lisa C. Congratulations, you guys. And Jenny B. And Jenny B. Those are the small, and then did I give you back my medium-sized one? Can I have it back? My angel light, maybe I can oh, give it back yes. to you. Just to show them the, the size difference, yeah. Thank you. This one fits perfectly on my middle finger. Okay, and then this is the medium size. The medium went to Dandelion K and Q Burt. Dandelion K and Q Burt, <coughs> congratulations. Lori L and Laura Ash. Lori L and Laura Ash. Chris G and Adele G. Chris G and Adele D. Renee and Inspire Light. Renee and Inspire Light. Congratulations, you guys. Happy Hippie and Betty Wong. Happy Hippie and Betty Wong. Karen C and Kristen M. Karen C and Kristen M. Deanna, Deanne Jordan and Christy, C, uh, Christy G. Deanne Jordan and Christy G. Melissa L and Katie Cat. Melissa L and Katie Cat. 
Ghost Nikki and Amanda R. Ghost Nikki and Amanda R. Nicole B and Cindy N. Nicole B and Cindy N. Heather F and Sharon S. Heather F and Sharon S. Kendall C and Frankie R. Kendall C and Frankie R. Congratulations, you guys. Deanna F and Katie Cat. Deanna F and Katie Cat. <coughs> And that's all she wrote for Angelite Rings. I'm so happy for you guys. Congratulations. Yvonne's like, I'm too slow tonight. Um, yeah, they're wondering about the Aventurine Spheres, too, the Portal oh, Spheres. The Portal Spheres. Let's do Portal Spheres, the Grey Aventurine Spheres with the Picasso Jasper base. You guys ready? Oh, I'm glad you guys are enjoying tonight. That makes me so happy. The Spheres went to Denise C. and Bridget O. Q Siren. Denise C. and Bridget O. got Portal Spheres. Scarlet and Cindy B. Scarlet and Cindy B. Congratulations. Um, Fojomon and Soul Motionista. Fo did you say Fojomon? Fo uh, yeah. Fojomon and Soul Motionista. That's Cindy. <laughs> Congratulations, you guys. Roxanne B. <laughs> Roxanne B. and Lee M. G. Roxanne B. and Lee M. G. That siren is serious. Congratulations, you guys. Lindsay W. and Teresa J. Lindsay W. and Teresa J. April C. and Sparrow. A April C. and Sparrow. Congratulations. Michelle N. and April B. Michelle N. and April B. Emily F. and Jan N. Emily F. and Jan N. <laughs> Congratulations, you guys. <laughs> it does a little bit, Amy. We uh, we may have found a new home for Sage Goddess today. I'll let you guys know when that comes to pass. But um, and it's nowhere near a fire department, so we may end up with no sirens next year when we move in if this uh, comes to pass. I know. I agree, Deborah. She said, "Notice how many countries are rising up right now. Our planet is awakening. It's really, really true." And I think we have to start to think about energy that way. I do have a, a Reiki four system that I downloaded and channeled of new symbols, and so I may still incorporate that into what I'm teaching beyond the basic one, two, three. You guys are getting me thinking tonight, which is great. Okay, I have a giveaway, and it's a very serious giveaway because this is um, a very powerful tool. This is one of the most beautiful clear quartz vogels I have seen. It is full of what we call divic temples, which are these really angelic inclusions or like little wispy clouds that come inside. And this is a stone for psychic surgery, for removing energy from the body, whether it's pain or discomfort or grief or sorrow or loss. This is about removing from your body and from your energy field energies that are too low, too dense, too uncomfortable for your body to work with. Um, and Vogels are expensive because they're harder to cut. You have to start with a really high quality piece of quartz too. <coughs> so usually we sell them, we don't give them away, but today this is our giveaway. Um, the value of this is about $129. So it's a really, really, really good giveaway. And all you have to do to enter is just say yes or please, or it's calling to me, or that's my medicine, or give it to me now. <laughs> any of those things will work and what you do is you want to open a circle and you want to create a portal for that energy that you remove to to go down through so that's a that's part of the process that you need to make sure that you do and then you go in to the energy field and out it's like an infinity symbol as you go in remove and out and in remove and out it actually becomes a really beautiful meditation to remove energy from the field Ooh. So let me see where uh, where I'm being called to. Isn't it beautiful? Vogels are big magic. They have their own frequency, their own vibration, their own... They're different. And if you want to really see the power of a Vogel when you get yours, a lot of times they create a vortex. And the way you can tell that is pendulums will sort of um, behave oddly around them. Watch what happens. They go in these really fast circles, and sometimes the circle will reverse itself as you sit with it, but they almost never make a straight line. And then watch, it might reverse itself. Oh my god, it's doing it. Do you guys see? In real time. <laughs> That's how you know your stone. It has a vortex of energy around it, and then sometimes it'll stop and reverse itself again. I can't believe it did it for you in real time. It's stopping now and watch, it's gonna go back the other way. Do 
you see how it's going back the other way now? I can't believe I was able to show you that in real time. That, is, that never happens. <laughs> so cool. Okay. <clears throat> Okay. Yeah, I had another I had two more of those pendulums, but I gave them away to my students this year. They fell in love with those. Okay, this piece is going to inspire light. I can feel that it's for you. Where are you, inspire light? <laughs> yeah, if you ever want to know if you have a really powerful piece, if there's a vortex around it, watch your pendulum. It'll go clockwise and stop and counterclockwise and stop and clockwise and stop and counterclockwise and stop because there's there's multiple energy streams running and your pendulum will be the only way that you can discern it. Isn't that amazing? All right, Inspire Light, my spirit guide said this is for you and that you have energy to remove and I'm really excited to hear how you work with it. <coughs> I hope she or he saw. But I'm thinking of you. This is definitely you for so you. Much. Oh, good. You're there. I'm so glad you saw. Congratulations. Very, very, very happy for you. May it heal you in beautiful ways and restore you to perfect health and in perfect time. Amen. Aho. And so it is. Isn't that fun? I love teaching you guys stuff. Honestly, like selling crystals is interesting, but it's way more fun to teach you. If I couldn't do both, I wouldn't want to do gym sales. Okay. Um, I have stuff to show you. So I'm going to show you really quickly a couple more things. I have these plates that you guys were asking about that we had made for Shadow Season. I have 16 of these. No, 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 hold on. I have four of these. <laughs> Sorry. Um, they're seven inches. These are hand carved out of Picasso Jasper, um, which is line the lineage stone. And what you do is you, you meditate. Each one of these is one of your family lines. And they say that the pieces find you, that you don't find them. Aren't these beautiful? So they're raw on the run side, and then they're polished on the other. So I have four of these, if you would like them. They are, the retail price is $99. They're $79. And so what you can do with these is then put all of your sacred tools on them, right? You can put your perfume and your candle. If you have this month's Mesa, look how beautiful it looks with it. That becomes an altar in and of itself. Isn't that stunning? I wish I had more of those. I know, I'm so sorry. They only had that amount of rough to carve for me, so they couldn't make more than four. So we'll come back and let you know who got those. And then I want to show you the green aventurine generators really quick. So this, this was my thing from Denver. Um, <laughs> Congratulations, those are so beautiful, aren't they? Um, green aventurine is the stone of good luck and new opportunities and fertility and growth. And I wanted big generators. When I went to Denver, they had five of these. And again, do your homework. These are the largest green aventurine generators online. Like they just don't exist. And this is the same thing. They mined it, they cut it, they polished it. It's all one person, one family. But this is all they had of this size. Aren't they beautiful? A lot of you want big generators. By the way, they're all beveled on the bottom too. Isn't it gorgeous? Can you believe these are only $4.99? Retail value on these is $7.99. Like you could go and sell this <laughs> for $7.99. So I only have five of these at $4.99 and that's it. And by the way, no more of this ever again. They made little ones, but they only made this size. Aren't they gorgeous? So um, you will not break my heart if you don't buy these because I'm still secretly hoping to save one for myself because I fell in love with these two. This is my stone. Like when I'm creating something new, when I'm birthing something new, when I'm imagining something new, green aventurine is always my go-to because it's also a heart chakra stone. So it, it helps to guarantee that whatever you create, you create it from love. Whatever you imagine, you imagine it from love. Isn't it beautiful? I know. Oh, it's solid. I mean, this is like, it's very heavy. I've got it on my knee because I can't hold it. And it's shipping to you for free. 
in the U.S. Like, it's $5 to ship it outside the U.S. Like, it's insane. This should be $25 or $30 just to ship it to you. That's why these gem sales are so fun, because it's like the biggest, best stuff. Look how th wide it is. Like, it's not like it's a thin little thing. This is... I don't know how heavy it is, but it's heavy. What would you say, Alexis? Like 15 pounds, maybe? Heavy, yeah. 15 pounds? Something on the order of 15 pounds. Isn't that cool? It's beautiful, isn't it? And it's all natural. This is green adventuring. This is not dyed or enhanced in any way. The real deal. Isn't it beautiful? So congratulations. We'll let you know who got those. And then the last thing I want to show you, one of the last things, actually, are these strawberry cords. I only have two of these. <laughs> same family that carved the green aventurine carved this and there are two of them um, I would love to see these go to the same person I know that's like hard to say but this would be so beautiful as a duo can you imagine it they're so big I can hardly like show it to you um, so what makes it pink or sort of red is hematite there's micro hematite in these. And so that's what, let me see if I can lift it to show it to you. But have you ever seen a generator like this where all of the layers are carved? Isn't that stunning? So it's quartz, which opens your crown chakra and hematite, which opens your root chakra. And when you open the crown and the root at the same time, you open the entire central channel and align all your chakras. So there are smaller ones of these that I took home from my bedroom. Not near my bed, because you don't want too much quartz near your bed, but on the far side I have a mantle, and I just, but this was too big. So I, whoever gets these, you're getting the bigger ones that I didn't have space for. I know, isn't it beautiful? It's not on a stand. It's its own stand. The retail value of these is $2,000 a piece. And it's heavy. Again, it's heavier than the green adventuring, so I'm having to stabilize it for you. Our price tonight, $1,099 for each one. Isn't it beautiful? And again, this is like showstopper stuff from Denver. If anybody wants the pair, I would do it for $2,000. So I'll take 100 off of each piece if you want to do the pair for $2,000. Because honestly, I really think they should go together if you can. These don't exist anywhere else in the world, and the person who carved them only made two. So if they're, you know, it would be really, really, really good for someone to have it on one mantle together. Um, but it really does look pink, even though it's hematite. It's like a sparkly pink. There's a little bit of black, and you you can see the red, too. Um, but it is all natural. Again, it's not dyed, not enhanced. This is natural hematite and quartz. Isn't it beautiful? Did Bridget do the pair? She did. Smart girl. Honestly, Bridget, if I had anywhere in my home that I had space for it, I would have done the pair too. This is beyond, beyond, beyond gorgeous. And I'm super glad that they're going home together. It's sort of like when you have puppies, you don't really want them going to separate homes. <laughs> like They love each other. These two should be together. So I'm really glad that you're giving them a home together. And congratulations. Super, super, super happy for that. That is so good. I can feel their happiness too. These have been waiting and we've all been waiting since we got back from Denver to see who would get these because you see a lot of things, but you don't see a lot of things like that. Isn't it beautiful? And then at the end of the day, when you need to ground in, it's like, ugh, you can just feel the energy of these. Aw, isn't that sweet, Frankie Rose? Okay, wands, do you wanna do wand winners? Yeah, sure. Okay. <coughs> I'm gonna give this back to you, Alexis, because it's sort of, occluding my view did you guys have fun tonight don't separate the kids says deborah clark <laughs> it's true the kids want to be together you guys crack me up okay the rose cord chakra chakra wands rose cord chakra wands say it 10 times fast I went to lorna s lorna s and jen a and jen a congratulations 
Helena A. and Deanna F. Helena A. and Deanna F. Congratulations. Stacy Marie and K. Grand. Stacy Marie and K. Grand. Naya Ree and Candace M. Naya Ree and Candace M. Congratulations. Er Erica N. and Cuber. Erica N. and Cuber. Allie T. and Kelly. Allie T. and Kelly B. Those are all the Rose Quartz Wand winners. The and then the Clear Quartz went to Lindsay W. and Laura Ash. Lindsay W. and Laura Ash, congratulations. Debbie C. and Leah Remain. Debbie C. and Leah Remain. Cindy R. and Mystic Gypsy. Cindy R. and Mystic Gypsy. Serena D. and Linda Y. Serena D. and Linda Y. Congratulations. Francine T. and Bonnie L. Francine T. and Bonnie L. Lena L. and Michelle Q. Lena L. and Michelle Q. Congratulations. Those are all the ones for the year. We have one more fancy wand I can show you um, in our collection. Well, I did want to do one additional thing, though, really quick. Okay. As you know, every time we have a gem sale, we do an item for charity. And the full purchase amount that you pay goes to the charity of your choice in your name. We don't take it as a tax donation. It's really just about putting good energy back in the field. We have this beautiful, and, it, and I mean beautiful, aquamarine, like jemmy, 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 aquamarine in sterling silver pendant from Denver. Aquamarine is the most powerful, emotional purifier and detox stone. It's so emotionally healing. It's the birthstone of Pisces, so it's all about imagination and creativity in love and about purifying your emotions. It's got a very gentle, almost a childlike energy to it. It's one of the largest aquamarine crystals, and that is a natural hexagon because, of course, aquamarine is a hexagonal crystal. It's a member of the barrel family, so it grows naturally in that six-sided form. Isn't that beautiful? So... Whoever gets this tonight, your full purchase price goes to the charity of your choice, and we're hoping that all that beautiful emotional purification energy will go directly to the charity that you choose. And the price of this piece is crazy. It's $129 for one of the largest aquamarines we've ever brought you in sterling silver. Isn't that beautiful? $129. And as soon as you get that, you need to get that on a chain and start wearing it. Isn't that beautiful? Are you a double Pisces, Fanja? Isn't that sweet? My daughter's a Pisces. Alexis is a Pisces. <laughs> a Isn't it gorgeous? Pisces double Pisces is intense. So, yeah, so whoever gets this, you're doing two beautiful things. You're getting yourself some emotional healing, and you're sending $129 off to a charity that we hope will get all of the energy of this crystal and all of your sweet energy, too. Isn't that beautiful and if you ever want to see where we donate like where all that money goes to on our homepage, sagegoddess.com at the top you'll find an about us section and there's a page called gives back and you can track all of the charities that have received funding from us both our own charitable donations because we personally donate a lot over the year and then also all of the donations that come through the live gem sales are you feeling the feelings? I love that so much. Congratulations, Tia. Can't wait to see where you have us send those funds on your behalf. Somewhere beautiful, I'm sure. And we appreciate you. Oh, I love that. Okay, is there anything left from tonight? I'm not sure. Um, that is not a question I have the answer to. We did have some earrings if you guys would like to see. We can show you that before we're done. These are for weight loss and clear sight. I'm going to put one in because I love these earrings. I cherry picked these in Denver because I fell in love with them. I like dangle earrings if I'm going to do it. I think they should show up. So I have 15 pairs of blue appetite earrings. The retail price on these is $99. Our price is $69. Aren't they beautiful? Yeah, Jan, we did. We sold the gray spheres, and we announced the winners of those, too. So if you missed that, you'll want to go back into the into the um, session afterward, and you'll be able to find that. Aren't they beautiful? I just think these are really sexy. They're really simple. They're very elegant. It's that really beautiful true blue appetite color, and they're super gemmy. We don't do a lot of earrings, so I know a lot of you are earring wearers, so I thought this would be fun for you. If you're like me, you can keep one and give one to a girlfriend or you can wear them both. Aren't they fun? <laughs> so Blue Appetite, the ancient Greeks thought it gave them dual sight. 
that they could tell if someone was lying to them or telling them the truth. If you have my book called Crystal Lore, you've probably read about Blue Appetite. Um, so appetite was supposed to be the stone of being able to tell something truth from something something true from something false. And energetically, in terms of the chakras, it activates the throat chakra, so it helps you find your voice, it helps you find your authentic power. And then appetite, blue and green, decreases the physical appetite, so it makes you less hungry, which means you consume fewer cal calories and therefore you lose more weight. So if you're trying to work on throat chakra stuff, weight loss, or finding your voice, like being able to speak your truth and ask for what you want and what you need in your life, this is kind of your airing. Or if you just want something beautiful. But I'm all about the medicine of the stones. And they're open on the back too, so the energy is coming through. Aren't they pretty? <laughs> Yvonne says she doesn't know what she's won. <laughs> so she doesn't want to bid. I understand that. We try to get it to all the winners during the session. Whatever we don't get through in the event, by the way, gets posted tomorrow on the event page. So if you bid on something and we don't announce the winner for that item, just know that everything will be listed out on the event page for you tomorrow. We also always put it into the feed. Oh, that's true too. Did you know yeah. that? Yeah, they, they, Team SG also puts the winners into the feed. So you should be able to know now, Yvonne, if you go back into the feed and look at the specific item, Team SG is typing the names for you there. I miss it a lot because I'm watching you, but if you're tracking the feed, you might be able to actually see in the list. I just like to say your name, so I sort of reiterate the winners, but you can also track the feed and make sure that you um, see if your name is there too. <laughs> Who got Ganesha's? Do you want to go over the Ganesha's really yes. quick? We can do that. That sounds like a plan. And then I have one more surprise up my sleeve for you before we say goodnight to you guys tonight. Ganesha's went to Norma F. and Jean K. Okay, Norma F. and Jean K. got Ganesha's. Congratulations. These are those beautiful garnet Ganesha's that I showed you earlier. Frankie R. and Deanna F. Frankie R. and Deanna F. Congratulations. Cindy R. and Denise G. Cindy R. and Denise G. <laughs> Jen's Pet Care and Lee M. G. Jen's Pet Care and Lee M. G. And Renee Helton. And Renee Helton. Those are those Garnet Ganeshas. Aw, thanks for that, Michelle. That means a lot. Yeah, so Rosie, we just had the Ganesha winners. Congratulations to you guys. And then um, there was one more wand. I can show it to you super quickly if you want to see it. It's very different, actually. Um, this is the last of those wands for a while made by my favorite wand maker. And what's really cool about this is it has a fairy stone, which is a specific type of concretion that occurs in Canada. And then this one has two different pieces of moldavite which is for astral travel and spirit communication. Then it has a double terminated shungite point on one end for purifying energy and clearing energy. And then it has spiderweb obsidian up here. So what happens is this wand gathers energy, channels energy, and purifies energy. So this would be a really good wand for clearing your physical body. Again, especially if you have pain or disease of any kind. I would consider it sort of an extraterrestrial healing wand. And it's beautiful too. But you rarely see them with the double terminated shungite like this. It's absolutely magnificent. So this one, our original price or retail price on this one is $7.99. Our price is $6.75 for Moldavite, Fairy Stone, Concretion, Spiderweb Obsidian, and then double terminated shungite in silver. Isn't that beautiful? Depends on what kind of work you're doing. So definitely for interdimensional healing and clearing, this would be a really good wand to work with. But that's a very specific type of per uh, person and someone doing a very specific type of healing and energy work. But you can kind of see the goddess there, can't you? They call them fairy stones because these unique concretions that come out of Canada, they, they tend to look like little little goddesses or little fairies in there. Isn't it beautiful? There's a little lady in there if you look closely. That's special. So this is still left. And then I'm not sure, is there anything else left from tonight? Um, so Nancy just took that wand. Ah, Nancy got that <laughs> wand. It's a beauty, Nancy, and I think you'll really love it. And I, what I love is it, it wouldn't have the same energy if he didn't put the Moldavite in there. But having those two pieces of Moldavite at the top and the bottom, for me, it, it makes me very... Um, there's like a zing to this wand. It makes me very buzzy. It opens up all my upper chakras. So if that's what you're, if that's the work that you're doing, I think you're going to connect with this one really quickly. It'd be a beautiful one for ceremony and journey work too. 
Um, and so let me check and see if there is anything else that's left, but I think that might be everything for tonight. Uh, yes, so we have... We do have one pendant left. Do you want to see it? <laughs> I will tell you, and I always say this with certain things. Again, if nobody wants this one, you will not break my heart because I cherry-picked it when we were in Denver, and there's only one like it. Which one is this one? It's the blue topaz or the blue opal. Yes, that's number 32. 30. Here it is. Okay. Okay, so this is in gold over silver. But it's 18 karat gold over silver. I'm going to show it to you on. Uh, so I walked by this piece, and then I turned around and walked back and got it. It, it. it was that strong of a call to me. Do you want to see the clear quartz flames too? We have four of them I can show you. Yeah. Okay, so let me show you what this is. This is Peruvian blue opal with garnet. And then it has blue topaz, cut and faceted blue topaz, and it's all open on the back. Have you ever seen blue opal like that? I had not seen blue opal like that. Maybe it's because it's in gold. Um, I said this was amber. No, this is blue. This is blue opal. I don't think we had any amber in the sale today. No. Unfortunately, no. Um, this I've never seen blue opal quite like this though. Um, and this is from this is Peruvian blue opal. So this one. The retail value on this one is 900. Again, keep in mind, all opals, right? Our price is 479 on that pendant. Like that. You'd want to get a gold chain, isn't it? There's, um, so blue opal is a stone of remembering. So it's interesting that you say that it's Isis vibes, Lindsay, because it's very much a stone of remembering who you are, where you came from, your lineage is something that blue opal activates. Isn't it beautiful? So I, I know. <laughs> or maybe I slipped Frankie and called it Amber. I'm not sure. Either you heard it wrong or I said it wrong. I'm always open to being wrong. So let's just assume mm -hmm. I said Amber and fucked up. <laughs> I know. No, but you know what? I mean, honestly, when I'm really called to something, I don't put it in the sales. I, I felt like it was mine. And then when I really sat with it, it's like, I don't think it is mine. But I, I certainly was drawn to it. I thought it was one of the most beautiful things I had ever seen. Because you just don't see blue opal, and you certainly don't see it with garnet and with blue topaz. Topaz is a stone of invisibility and healing, and garnet is a stone of grounding and protection. So this is about remembering your past, but integrating it in a safe way into your life today. And it, whoever takes this piece has some really interesting work to do, right? I know. <laughs> a cord would be really pretty on that, actually, like a black cord so that it wouldn't take away from the design. Okay, so um, we do have clear quartz flames. I'll show you this really quickly. Um, and then I have two things to tell you about on the website and I will let you go. Um, we have four clear quartz flames. But the surprise with these is that you get not just the flame, but you are getting a soulmate's candle from us made here at SG and summon perfume, which is our attraction blend. It's our oldest attraction blend here at SG. The stories I could tell you about Summon are pretty crazy. When we used to hire people at SG, we used to burn Summon. And people would just like walk in the door with all the skills that we needed for the job that we were looking for. It's a really powerful blend. Okay, so you get this massive clear quartz flame, which by the way, the way you work with flames, this one's full of rainbows. So you put the flat side against your solar plexus and you hold it out like this. And it creates a portal of energy around you. In this case, it's quartz, so it's magnification and intensification. So that's how you work with a flame. You can work with it other ways too, but that's the primary reason why it's flat on the bottom, so it creates this energy around your solar plexus, okay? So, the original price for the flame with the candle and the perfume was $199. Tonight, our price is $169 for all three. Isn't that cool? It's pretty, when you think about the fact that the candle and the perfume would retail for 50, so you're basically getting a clear quartz flame like this for about $110, $115, and this would retail for $160 on its own. So but we only have four of, this, of the sets for you tonight. Isn't that fun? 
And by the way, this you should use on 1111. So the whole reason we're doing this at the end of October, this will reach you by 1111, which is Twin Flame Soulmate Day. And so we're hoping you're going to anoint with summon and burn your candle and hold your flame. And that will call in a twin flame or a soulmate. It'll also call in anything else that you see because 11 and 11 is a master day. So it's a really important day for ceremony and setting intentions and all of that. So carnelian flame is the same thing, Mandy Smith, but carnelian, right? So instead of opening a flame of magnification and intensification, it opens a flame of endurance and strength and stamina, which is what carnelian represents. So the flame shape you can work with in any stone. If it's rose quartz, that's pure love energy. If it's an aventuring flame, it's pure joy and good luck and new beginnings energy, right? So it just sort of depends on what the energy of the stone is. That was a great question, though. I'm glad you asked it. A lot of people don't know. Okay, so I'm going to show you two things that are on sagegoddess.com, and then I'm going to release you from my grasp for tonight, and then my students will have to get ready for another three hours of me tomorrow. We have uh, Soul Shift, Session 4, Crafting and Integration. The rest of our integration is happening tomorrow. Okay, so um, today on sagegoddess.com, we had some really popular things. We had the citrine ring, we had track perfume, which I made coming out of ayahuasca ceremony, and a couple of other really beautiful things, and a lot of you shopped. So I'm doing a really special Enter to Win. For anybody who made a purchase on sagegoddess.com today, if you haven't shopped yet, there's still time. So until midnight tonight, but if you've already shopped, you don't have to do anything else. This heart, um, I've been having a relationship with for a couple of weeks. This is from Denver. Carved by the same family that carved the adventuring generators and the strawberry quartz points tonight that Bridget got. Okay, so same man, same family. Isn't it beautiful? It's a standing heart. So the retail value of this is 299 but I'm going to send it in the order of someone who shops on sagegoddess.com today. Isn't that cool? So a lot of you, like I said, have already shopped. You're good. Um, uh, so your live sale purchases do not count because you're already getting a huge price discount. So that's your gift. This is for anything on sagegoddess.com. Plus it's hard for my team to track who, which purchases come from where. So anything on sagegoddess.com between midnight last night and midnight tonight counts. And like I said, a lot of you have already been shopping today, so if you've already shopped, don't worry. Um, the two things I wanted to tell you about, I wanted to make sure you saw that we had natural chrysocolla on the website in three different sizes. This is the feminine healer stone. This is throat chakra, physical healing, divine feminine energy, softness, sensuality, beautiful and we haven't had big natural chunks like this in a long time so this is one thing i'd recommend for you and then like i said if you didn't see the natural citrine ring that i've been wearing on my finger that's still on the website and this was custom made for us some of you are collecting our custom jewelry this was custom made for us this was custom made for us and this was custom made for us too and if you're all done shopping then don't worry but I thought it'd be really sweet to offer this to you because I, I, in all my journeys and travels, I've never seen, and it's a very light smoky quartz, but it's covered in rainbows. And I've never seen a standing heart like that before. So we hope you love it. And someone special is gonna get this in their package. I'm just gonna pack it up with your order and ship it off to you. And we'll announce who got this one too so that you guys can all celebrate with them. Enjoy. Well, I'm glad. So the citrine rings are there. The chrysocolla is there. If any of that's interesting to you, you say yes to the heart. I love that. <laughs> yeah, we're not repeating our ring designs. So everything that we do that's custom, when they sell out, we're on to the next thing. We already have the next six designs in progress right now. So we're doing this really cool limited edition jewelry. And um, so you're ending up with collector's items, which I think is really, really cool and exciting for you guys. Citrine ring is not adjustable. Some of the custom stuff we're doing is not because the designs just don't lend themselves to it. So this one will fit you at your regular size or a quarter size or half size up. Like I'm wearing mine at half size up, but it's a little bit wider. So even if you have to go half size up, it'll still fit you really well. Uh, thanks, you guys. Well, today was really special, don't you think? Some of the most beautiful things we've ever brought you. So I want to thank you guys. I want to thank Hannah and Alexis. 
Um, if you didn't see your name and were wondering if you won something, just keep in mind it's in the feed and also we will be listing all of the winners of all of the products tomorrow. If you're new, so you're going to get an invoice within 24 hours and then you have 24 hours to pay your invoice and then your item will ship to you afterward. And then we'll be back two weeks from tonight for the next edition but we'll already be into November can you believe it it's hard to believe so you're gonna start seeing more and more holiday goodness coming your way get ready and get excited for that but I want to thank you guys for being here tonight and some of the things that you got tonight were absolutely what I would consider to be the best possible whatever it is jewelry stones carvings that we could bring you it was really fun to share these special things with you and I hope you learned a lot too along the way so congratulations, you guys. We love you a lot. We'll see you either in class tomorrow or for Cosmic Comfort on Thursday. I hope you can join us. That's our free offering to you guys, beautiful meditation and teaching. So if you're not in class, please join us back for uh, Cosmic Comfort at 4 o'clock on Thursday. We'll see you then. Have a great night, you guys. We'll see you. Take good care. We'll see you in the meantime.